I used a small can of tomato sauce, a half a cup of brown sugar, a tablespoon of chili garlic sauce, Vietnamese chili garlic sauce, various other spices, about a tablespoon of soy sauce, a tablespoon of molasses, a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar, and I season to taste with cumin, garlic powder, and uh, that's it. But really what, what I'm just going to do now is let this simmer. It's got a beautiful rich taste. And also I added a cap full of liquid hickory smoke. That's another good secret about making homemade barbecue sauce. You can add liquid smoke to that to get a different flavor. I like it the way it is. But basically that is all a barbecue sauce is. is a tomato base with sugar and other seasonings. So there's my homemade barbecue sauce. I'm going to put it on my pork steaks and I'm going to go throw on the grill. Okay, I've got some pork steaks on the grill with a little bit of no salt seasoning and a little bit of salt, of course. And we're just going to grill these uh, well, of course. And pork steak is probably one of the cheaper cuts you can get and it feeds a lot. Um, it's just for me and Cassie today. Nobody's here. But we'll have leftovers. That's a good thing. So I'm going to close it up and let them cook and then I'm going to come back and put on my homemade barbecue sauce. Here's here's the barbecue sauce. This is how it should be. Nice and thick. It simmered for about 30 minutes. Here's my steaks. Those are done. I like my pork really well. So I'm going to go ahead and put some barbecue sauce on top of those and then we'll show you the finished product.